Hey guys, it's John. This video is sponsored by Shudder. Shudder is the premium streaming video service from AMC Networks. Shudder was built specifically for fans of thrillers, horror, and suspense. In other words, you! You can stream all the thrillers, horror, and suspense you want for just $5.99 a month or $56.99 per year. You'll get access to the largest and fastest growing human curated selection of thrilling and dangerous entertainment, which you can stream ad-free on all your favorite devices. Shudder has a unique collection of exclusive and original films and series, horror classics, and blockbuster hits. To try Shudder free for 30 days, go to Shudder.com and use promo code JohnWolf. Speaking of exclusives, I recently watched Mandy. Do you like Nicolas Cage? You should absolutely watch Mandy. Even if you don't, you should still absolutely watch Mandy. It starts off as a slow burn, but later it goes off the rails. The payoff is great. It came out last year, and it's only on Shudder. When you're watching it, look out for some red means scary moments. There's a lot of red in this movie. Also, hopefully you've watched Boar by now, but if you're in a campier mood and you haven't seen it, you must. That's an order. To see these movies and more, try Shudder free for 30 days by going to Shudder.com and using promo code John Wolf. That's my promo code. It's my name. Hey guys, it's John, and welcome back to another edition of Random Horror Games, the series in which I play random horror games that I find online. Today we're going to be starting things off with Carnahel Valley, which is just a game I found. I'm guessing it's about clowns. Let's go ahead and check it out. If you want to see previous episodes of Random Horror Games, there's a playlist link in the description where you can watch all 30 of them or so. There's quite a few at this point. Been doing this for about a year, I think. The whole reason we moved here was that beautiful mountain range view. Mountain range? There's just one mountain. Disappointing. This forest was once full of life. Okay, well now everything's dead, I guess. But this traveling circus came to town. And now we live in a cave? Is that the next sentence? <laughs> Where are we right now? And this place has never been the same. Okay. Where did we just come from? Oh, I guess we came from town. And we can't get back to town because there's an invisible wall blocking our way. Well, let's trudge through the mud. This is the way to the circus my family, quote, went to. What do you mean they went to it? I should stick to the trail. I don't want to get lost. Oh, I wasn't even thinking about gallivanting out into the nether over there. Endless dead trees. This forest, it wasn't like this. The trees were lush and full of life. What could have killed all these trees, guys? Could it have been the evil clowns? I like how the developer is like, better stay on the main path, because the map literally ends right there at the horizon. Can I go out there and see? Better not. I mean, we don't have all the time in the world to waste looking over the edge and saying, guys, it's the end of the map. Uh -huh. But I bet it is. I bet I'm right. <laughs> Who's there? Show yourself! So, this welcome to the freak show circus thing is blocking our path back. I should have grabbed my flashlight out of the house. Diary updated? What could the diary possibly say? I wish I had gotten my flashlight. I heard this place was haunted. Didn't realize how haunted. Time to investigate the disappearance of my kids. I really need to find something to help light the way. I left my flashlight at the house, and now the way back is blocked. Why would you not bring it with you? Okay. So wait. Your kids went to the circus by themselves. Why did the children go to the circus by themselves? Alright, whatever. Let's see some clowns. Is that something over there? What can my diary say? Search the area. 
Imagine scribbling, search the area in your diary. I don't get the static, like... Do we bring a camera with us? Hey, it's a... thing. Robert, I am fine. I was able to get away. We should never came to this circus. That thing grabbed mom and took off with her. I tried to follow, but lost them in the fog. I found a cave and made camp. This kid's got survival skills. And I don't think it knows. Meet me there if you can. I'm not staying long. I want to find mom. Please be okay, Robert. Alice. Okay, wait, hang on. So Robert is us, but Robert says that he has to find his kids. This person says the things grabbed mom. I'm confused. Is this the wife? Or the daughter? I know from Alice to her brother. I must be getting close. <laughs> oh, so it wasn't for me. I think I'm seeing things. I have to keep going. My... My kids? I need to get back to the trail. Maybe it leads to the cave. Yes, the clandestine cave that the trail leads to. Sure. I swear to God, if there's just a cave at the end of this. Up. Oh. I can't see it, but there's a skeleton right there. <laughs> there it is. Okay. The circus is right outside the cave. And you don't think that it knows that you're here. Looks like someone has been here before. Maybe I can find a flashlight somewhere in here. You're obsessed with this flashlight. Search the cave. Once again, a strange diary entry. Okay. What the F? <laughs> what the frick? What the fresh print? There's a... There's a clown. But then he disappeared. Okay, now where? Circus tent drawing? With two people in it. I guess one of my kids was supposed to have drawn that. They're reflecting on their fun time at the circus. When the clowns grabbed mom and took her away forever. And they had to hide in a cave or else they would get killed. Note from Robert added to inventory. Looks like both kids are here. I gotta find them fast. Alice, it's your brother. Did you get away? Please, God, be okay. I ran as fast as I could when I saw that thing. I'm sorry we got separated. Meet me at our spot in the park. If I'm not there, leave me a note so I know you're okay. Don't stay there too long. You have to keep moving with that thing out there. Robert. Wait, I can use this. There's a, there's a button that says use. I don't know why that's there. All right, we're looking for a flashlight, though. <laughs> There's a big old mallet here for us to doink other cartoon characters on the head with, I suppose. I hear running water. Where's the flashlight? Wait, is that it? Is that the flashlight? Found a flashlight. Time to get out of here and find my kids. Maybe they went through that circus tent in the distance. God, I hope they got away from whatever chased them here. So, yeah, let's bring this out. Okay, let's go back out, I guess. That, that was an ordeal. My kids, where? Ha! Ha ha ha! What? Why are you laughing right now? I don't understand that at all. Ha ha! Okay, there's a blood trail. Naturally, we follow it. I think I'm losing my mind. Oh, children, where are you? And then he just randomly says, fuck you. What? Why? <laughs> Am I the clown? I don't know. Whatever, man. Do we go off to the side? There's a trail over here that's leading somewhere else. Oh, this is the circus tent. Well, I guess we go inside. What was that? 
Oh! Hello. Okay. He's faster than me. Is he still after me? Yeah, he is. Wow. Is that... Am I getting pummeled to death? Wow, no sound effects or anything, huh? I guess he hit my ears first. Okay. So the clown's just randomly patrolling. Ow. Oh, you have health! So I guess he whacked me once. Now I'm dead. This time I got a you died screen. Wow. <laughs> Not just the clown soundlessly thwacking me to death. Why don't we take that mallet that we saw in the cave with us? Why don't we take this with us? Then we can doink him on the head a couple times. Knock some sense into him. Oh my god, is he... Put the flashlight down. Go around the side. There he is. What? How did you spot me? I don't like that the clown is faster than you. Kind of annoying. If I turn my flashlight off, I mean, it's not really doing anything for me. Maybe he'll lose me in the fog. I don't know, let's just go into the circus tent. What, there's another one! Ow! Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Alright, I think I've seen enough of Carnahell Valley. Let's... <laughs> a nonsensical dialogue. Really empty game. I don't get what appeal this is supposed to have besides ooh spooky clowns. Let's go ahead and just move on to the next game. This is a game called Forgotten Tapes, and it has an incredibly scant menu. Uh, just real quick, if you're curious about Carnahell Valley, the game that I just played, I looked up the ending to it. You won't believe it. Or maybe you will. It's just based on what we saw already of the game. As soon as you walk through the entrance to that tent, the game ends. It says, thanks for playing, more to come. Which is just par for the course, isn't it? Let's go ahead and play tape, I guess. Blue. Oh, I thought it would be red. Oh, <laughs> here it is. Ooh. Frame rate on this is odd. I think it's meant to be like this. This is, uh, some low poly stuff. Okay. I guess we can't go that way. All right, guys, our first obstacle in this game is quite formidable. We must figure out how to get across these desks. What did I just do? <laughs> I just rubbed against it and it sounded like something opened. What? I can see through the floor. I don't think I'm supposed to be able to see that. There's no controls screen, by the way. Modern. Let's see what happens when I hit modern. Oh, it just... It's 16.9 now, and the frame rate's better. How do you get... I am feeling real stupid right about now. Oh, here's a flashlight. Oh my god, okay. You go over this way. I feel a smooth draft of air opposing my direction, which is a line you can't read if the flashlight's on. All right. Forgotten Tapes is not impressing me so far, but let's give it a chance. Apparently our name is Haley, and we fell into a place that has nothing in it. All right. Press middle mouse button to look behind you while in a chase. Why are you telling me that now? Why are we dressed like Lara Croft? And why is this light blinding? All right. 
Where does this lead? <laughs> You're asking that now? You've already <laughs> dropped down several levels. Oh my god, this light is blinding. There's a, there's a lamp down here. Who constructed this place? There are so many dead ends. I guess they just like inconveniencing themselves. Okay. Press left shift or left thumbstick to run! Is there anything behind us? Will we be able to hear if something's behind us? Who are you? An angry, angry man! It's a Twitter user! Come back here! Ah! Wow! Oh, someone's mad! What's this? A door that's locked. Apparently, we must go recover a key. Well, trying to avoid the angry screaming man. Okay. That's not the right way. Okay. What's this? Okay. This is a place to hide. That's cool. So this is a maze game at its core. Let's look behind us. Go inside. Oh, he's an idiot. He's an idiot, ladies and gentlemen. He's about to turn around, I think, because there's a dead end right there. Maybe not. Maybe we're all good. Then he killed me. Okay, I think I've gotten my fill of this one. Let's move on to another game, please. This is a game called Okari. It's a Japanese horror game on Steam for $3. Let's go ahead and start it off. Okay, here we are. It's late, I have to get back home. Huh. Wait, this seems really familiar. This is exactly how, uh... Shadow Corridor starts off. Where's my home again? <laughs> are you okay? I swear this is the intro to the game Shadow Corridor. It starts off exactly like this. I guess this isn't the way that we're supposed to go. I Is this our home? It is. Apparently. Ah, okay. Here we are at home. I'm back. <laughs> that sounds kind of threatening. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. Okay. All the doors in my own home are locked. Don't you just hate it when you don't know where your house is? So you have to just randomly stumble into a home. You assume it's yours, but then as you go throughout the abode, you discover that all the doors are locked. I make sure to lock up all the doors in my house before I leave for the evening. If this is locked. Okay, one of them is open. Is it, is it downstairs? I would guess it's... Eh? Mom? Are you in here, Mom? Maybe it's just me. We are so much taller than the fridge. 
Do they have short fridges in Japan? I mean, come to think of it, we're pretty tall just in general. We're almost uh, level with the top of the door frame. So maybe we're a giant. I heard a knock. What was that? Was it a... Was the knock over here? Oh, okay, so that's why you forgot where you lived, because you've only lived here for a week. Okay. You know, I can... I can kind of understand that. I guess. I'll suspend disbelief for now. Neat. We can go into the closet if we want. Us. Neko chan? Neko chan? Neko chan? I say it as American as possible. Hey, you mind turning some lights on in here? Yeah, maybe turn on some lights too. It's really dark. Oh, you can turn film grain off. Uh, the game's a lot more pleasant to look at now. Alright, I guess this is one of those games where you just have to... Oh, cat on the clock. What does that mean? Mom isn't feeling so well. Is mom sick? In the head or the body? When was the last time I watched the TV? I don't know. Why are you asking me? I don't keep track of your activities. Uh, there's some donuts out. Let's have some. Come on! Oh, I'm hungry. In real life. Anything I can interact with here? Plant, maybe. Chair. Here? I'd be happy to let you in. Okay, music starting now. Kagami o kagami, sekai de ichiban tsukushii no adare. Nante ne. Great joke. I got an achievement for doing that, by the way. <laughs> I feel so accomplished. I pressed E on the mirror. That's a rare achievement right there. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Is that a flashlight we picked up? It got dark. Thanks for filling me in, because last I checked, it was... Not dark at all. Okay. Wait. Oh, I thought the mirror was over here, but it's not. Great. What? They're obsessed with this pillow that has a seashell on it. It says beach. Huh? Seven. That's odd. Why is that on the wall? Must have been from the previous occupants. Oh. Huh? Okay, I guess I'll find all the other numbers that are on the wall. Right? Ooh. Someone there? Thought I heard someone. Kettle, toilet, tatami, storage, my room. Kettle, toilet... Let me read that again. Kettle, toilet, tatami, storage, my room. Hmm. I see. Is it telling me the order to put the numbers? So this is my room. So there should be a number in here then. Unless I'm mistaken. 
Unless this isn't my room. Maybe that's the, oh, that's, the mom wrote that note. Okay, let's go downstairs. Oh, that was actually kind of cool. That was actually kind of cool and subtle. Oh, come on. She walks this way, though. What's this? Two. So that's toilet. So that's the second number. These are upside down. Kettle, huh? This? What's this? Seven. It's another seven. So we got two. Seven, seven. Close it. No, I didn't want to lock myself in here. Okay. There's definitely one in the closet. Ah. Uh. Nine. Two seven nine seven ish is what we have right now. Two seven nine seven. All right. I don't think we've found kettle yet. I think we've found all the rest of them. So two blank seven nine seven. Kettle. Oh, here it is. Four. Okay, so four, two, seven, nine, seven, or I have to recheck the order. Here it is. Kettle, toilet, tatami, storage, my room. Four, four, two, nine, seven, seven, actually, I think is what it is. Let's go try it out. Aha. Is this a debt? Okay, papers scatter all over the floor. You okay? Oh, this is open now. <gasps> oh. So our mom hung herself due to overwhelming debt? Financial turmoil, and I guess we're reading the suicide note four hours later Okay, what are we doing now? It's out in the middle of the woods You know what's crazy so this is the regular walking and now I'm gonna press shift it just like removes one set of footsteps. I don't know why. Regular walking? Sprint. It removes one of the sets of footsteps. I don't know. Okay. I'm sorry, is there someone out here with me? No thank you. Where are we going right now? Ah, so now it is our turn, eh? Can we choose something else? Okay. I got an achievement. It, it says videotape and then a bunch of numbers. Okay. Alright guys, smash that like button! Great game! Everyone feeling good today? Everyone having a great time? Okay, so that was Okary. And that's gonna wrap up this edition of three random horror games. I haven't actually done three in a video in a long time. I've done a lot of fours and fives and even seven, but not three. So, uh, yeah, let's review. So first we played... Carnahel Valley which was something. 
And then we played Forgotten Tapes, which wasn't even something. And then we played this game, which was kind of all right. I think my assessment of the game is already in the title. It's okay. <laughs> it's an okay game. I liked the atmosphere in some parts. I like the subtlety of some of the creepy moments. I like seeing the mom walk past the staircase as I was going downstairs. I hadn't seen that particular angle before. And I'm getting to the point where I'm gonna give points to games for using angles that I haven't seen before. So yeah, it was all right. Uh, I don't know if it's worth three bucks considering it was like 12 minutes long, but you know, I, I don't think that there's alternate endings by the way, I looked at the achievements. Anyway, let me know what you thought about uh, this edition of Three Random Horror Games. Thanks again to Shudder for sponsoring the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Think critically.